Hi, thanks for joining. Um, it's midsummer now and the trout have turned their attention to smaller flies. So the one I'm going to tie today, um, a small terrestrial type fly, it's uh, a flying ant. It's done in the size 18. The hook I've got in the vise is a, an 18 uh, 230BL haddock. Um, the thread I'm going to use is black uh, uni and it's in uh, 8 o. We'll, we'll get on tying. So we'll start just behind the eye. Work our way down towards the bend and then we're going to go around the bend with this fly and then back up. Now we want the back end to be quite bulbous because Ant's got a, a bulbous uh, rear end to it. So I'm going to just do a little bit of shape there. Now what we're going to use um, for the flotation of the fly is Tiemco Aero Wing. This is the standard size, so it's uh, it's it's quite uh, quite thick. It's great great uh, recovery on this material. I love it for dries. So that's going to be the body. So I've I've took the length off. I'm going to tie that in. Go around the bend. Back up. Now, for the underbody, I'm going to use um, green peacock hurl. Lovely stuff, this, for underbodies. The natural uh, green fluorescence of the peacock curl takes some beating for small flies so we'll, we'll tie that in and then we'll start winding it around this gives the Illusion of um, legs. So we'll make a fairly big underbody. I'll do it. And then we'll flatten this if we can and then bring it over the top because this is going to be oh, it. and then we'll go back a bit just check that mm. Shining through there nicely. Now the the um, wing part of it is going to be um, fine grey Tiemco Aero wing. So we don't want a lot of this. We'll just stick it on the top. And then hold it. Go back towards the the rear part of the fly. We're gonna open that up, and then just take the thread through the middle, just to keep it split. That's it. 
Now, I'll, I'll trim them later when we're finished. The front end of the fly, I'm going to take this back over, over the arrow wing, bind it down, and then just put some more peacock curl for the front end as well. So we'll take another little bit. in and then just wind this back and there we are. snip that off and then again Flatten this bit to make my head over the top. Don't want too big a head because obviously the, the back end that's bigger normally. And then round the front, make sure I'm sitting okay. Check it, yeah. That green shining through nicely. And then what we do, we'll just take the scissors. And leave a tiny little head like that. So we'll, we'll have a little touch of super glue to, to hold that front end or varnish, whichever you like. Put a little, little dot on there and then just finish it off. And then we'll trim the wings. I want the wings coming just behind the body, like so. And there you have your flying ant. You can dink that up, the, the body material of the aero wing, the black bit and the white bit. That'll take the gink and that'll float lovely on the surface. And uh, when the cow sees these, they'll be straight up and, and eat them. So, hope you like it. If you do, give it a like. If you haven't already subscribed to the channel, please do. It makes a big difference. And check out uh, the fishing videos as well. Thanks very much. Cheers now.